Yeah, the other day I was digging around in the basement looking for something else and I found this old Sears silver tone cloth covered portable radio that runs on either AC or battery power. Frankly, it's been around here so long I don't even remember what all I did to it. I, looking in the back, I can see where I did something to it, which I'll show you in a minute, but it's been something that's it's been sitting here for years, so I plugged it up, and it does work, but it has a lot of, sounds like bad filter capacitor hum, so but I'll turn it on and show you what it does. Of course, this is just AM. is not that great down here in the basement. But yeah, it de definitely sounds like it needs some capacitors. And you can see it's just a cloth covered portable. It needs to be cleaned up. Here's the inside of the radio. This is a six tube set. And I think what I ended up doing to this was the original rectifier tube was bad, which I believe is a 50Y6. And I replaced the tube with a resistor and a solid state silicon diode just, just to get the radio going, but obviously it needs more work. Here to, let's see here. Here we go. Here are the battery cables. takes two batteries and series for the filament and two batteries and series for the B plus probably probably takes either seven or nine volts for the filament and ninety volts for the B plus but I'll have to double check that here's the back cover for the radio and we still have our schematic diagram listed here this radio uses a oscillator mixer stage, uh, two IF stages, a detector first audio stage, an audio output stage, and of course the rectifier stage. So, but yeah, I, I kind of like these cloth covered portable radios. This is a, let's see, what's the model of this thing? Model 6861 Silvertone. And the chassis number is 110.412 now. Whatever chassis prefix, manufacturer's prefix, 110 stands for, that'll indicate who actually made this radio, but, but yeah, I intend to restore this one day. Might even build a battery pack for it so I can use it as a portable. Okay, there you go, my early 40s cloth-covered silver-tone portable radio. Thanks for watching, and more to come 